You have the option to automatically reassign records that meet criteria after a set amount of time. This feature uses SLAs to enforce your time-based response targets. If you've not yet set up SLAs, you'll want to go back and watch those videos first. Distribution Engine periodically checks SLAs for any records that have been missed and then alerts. If an alert is fired, Distribution Engine then checks for any auto-reassign rules on that alert. If there is one that applies, the record will be taken from its owner and reassigned to a queue or user based on the rule configuration. Let's look at how these are set up. To configure reassignment, you can navigate to any existing distribution team that has SLAs configured. Click to the Tracking and SLAs section on the left-hand menu. On the top of this page, there is Team Level and Distributor Level. Click Distributor Level and a list of the distribution team's distributors will be displayed. Click on the distributor you would like to edit and a window will pop in from the right-hand side. If SLAs are not toggled on, toggle it on first. Then toggle on Auto Reassign. Next, you will need to configure which SLA you would like records to be reassigned on. These SLA choices refer to the configuration setup at the team level. Clicking to that tab, we can see the team has configured alerts at 30, 60, and 90 minutes with the sequence of 1, 2, and 3. Let's say you want to reassign your records on the third SLA at 90 minutes. Back on our distributor level, you'll select SLA 3 because you want the third alert at 90 minutes. Now you'll need to configure what you would like to do with the record once it has missed that third SLA. You can assign it to a queue or you can choose to assign it to a user. Maybe this is a manager or a senior user. You can optionally configure a field to update on reassignment. Maybe you'll select status and change that value to reassigned. Next, you can choose to automatically toggle off the team member that missed that SLA if the distribution engine widget is enabled. This helps make sure that records are not continually being assigned to a user that may be out of office or unable to handle additional work. Click Save and your auto-reassignment is all set up.